Hello, Facebook. I'm here at our community service project, uh, the girls' house, and I wanted to just, I was thinking about how awesome I feel like it is to see how much progress we made in two weeks' time. When I first started this project with the rest of my group, and I learned what we were trying to do within two weeks' time, raise $50,000, um, and remodel and renovate like two properties and make them super fabulous for the residents, I was like, whoa, that seems like a lot for 40 people to handle. Um, and it's been really amazing through this process to see not only like the magic that we've created at both of these locations, but to see how with resourcefulness, you can absolutely get anything done. Like I am a firm believer in things are possible 100% of the time, like anything is possible. And when I feel that way on my own, like when I create a new goal for myself or I'm excited to do something and I'm just like, I'm going to do this, then it's one of those things where I have no doubts I can do it. But when there's other people involved, sometimes you're like, oh man, is everybody else going to pull their weight? Like, are we actually going to get this done? It's amazing to see what can happen when you're resourceful. All of us reached out to our contacts. All of us uh, contributed. And even those of, uh, those of our team who were out of state, they were able to call local places for donations and um, just participate in any way that they possibly could and it's been amazing seeing all of this completely come together in such a short amount of time this backyard in itself is so magical I can't even wait to show you which I'm going to in just one second um, but it really made me think like any time in life that I've ever said that I want to do something I get it done but it's really interesting because I never get it done on my own I always have to reach out to people and reach out to my circle and support my friends in order to support me and I need to enroll people in the vision that I have for what I want to accomplish in life. When John and I moved across the country, that was something that we needed a lot of support from friends and family. Um, when we, when John quit his job <laughs> and we embarked on our own in real estate, we ended up having to borrow money from my parents. So I am a firm believer in everything that's possible 100% of the time. And I feel like as I've been going through this training process through Ascension Leadership Academy, it's been proven to me over and over again that that is 100% the case. It's amazing to see what you can accomplish when you simply dream, declare it, and deliver it. And for me, I really like declaring the goals that I have so that others around me can really hold me accountable and also like hold me to my shit. Be like, hmm, Melissa said she was going to move across the country six months ago, and she hasn't. Hmm. So if that's how I declared things and didn't take action, how do you think that people would you know, react when I would think of something else that I want to do. They'd probably be like, oh yeah, this, Melissa's just going to add this to the list of things she wants to do. And how often do you do that for yourself? Do you often create dreams for yourself and then not really take action? Do you tell your friends and family, do you declare it, but then never, never do anything about it? Um, so <laughs> Nance, yes, dream, declare, deliver. Um, I'm all about that. So I'm going to give you guys a quick little tour of this backyard because it's so magical. It's like an oasis now. Um, and just a reminder to you guys, like anything is possible. And if you're, if you have a goal or a dream that you've been putting off or that you haven't been taking action on, let's talk about it and let's see what's in the gap and what's holding you back because everything, anything, all the things in life are a thousand percent possible and you are absolutely going to achieve them. It just takes the mind, because the power of the mind is the most powerful tool. Growth mindset is huge. Knowing and believing and actually feeling like you can do whatever it is that you want to do, that's where it all starts. It all starts in here. So, just that little message for you guys. Let's check out this backyard. Okay, so I'm in the very corner of the backyard. It's kind of like a triangle shape. And what we did in this area over here is we actually installed, we cleaned up the space a little bit. We installed some lights. So this is a really like magical area at night. They had some mature, mature citrus trees. Um, so that's a beautiful addition to this yard, even though we didn't have anything to do with it. Look at how pretty this tree is full of oranges. And then over here, we built a little garden. So you can see there's like tomatoes over here. Here's an herb garden. This is so amazing. Hey guys, look at this. Oh, there was a little lizard. He already, we already lost him. Um, so we did some landscaping back here, rearranged some of these pathway rocks, created this herb garden, and yeah, we still have some garbage to clean up, of course. We're just in the home stretch right here. Um, but yeah, things are looking awesome. And yeah, there's this little like bird fountain that we installed. 
and we got them some patio furniture so they can enjoy dinners outside um, so this is just the outside let me see let me see what's going on on the inside and then for those of you who may have seen some of my posts early this room it used to be lime green or pistachio greenish I guess is the correct term so we painted and made these really nice and neutral um, did some work here in the kitchen and painted that so yeah things are coming along really awesome here at the project and it's been so cool to be a part of it and to see everything really come together and how important teamwork is and how important really dreaming declaring and delivering can be how powerful of an action that can be so hope you guys are having a great Sunday I will talk to you soon